Hi guys, how you doing? I'm in my favourite place again, Rabat, right up by Endina. It's very historical here and there's many catacombs. Um, I've got some good videos coming up of the St Paul's catacombs. Um, I don't know if I did something, I think you probably got it already, the walk from Emdina to Rabat. Anyway, we're in the back streets, listen to these birds. They must be over here somewhere. Look at the weather today, guys. Now, we're a bit lucky because uh, La lives up here when he's over. And he's over for a short time. And he went into the local baker, we're a bat. Which is a really old bakery. Actually, it's on the same ground as St Paul's Church. And uh, when they built it all those years ago, I'm not sure what the, what the year is, but I'll put it underneath. It's an old bakery, make traditional Malti, uh, Hobza Tal Malti. They make Ftira, they make those Babushu, make all the old things, apple pies, jam tarts, everything like traditional. And he had a word with the guy when he went to buy the bread. And he's, um, would it be all right if my mate comes over and does a little bit of video? Says, yeah, come over. And I, I don't think they speak a lot of English. <laughs> so we'll have a go and try and force him into speaking English for, I know there's a lot of expats that speak Maltese, but I've got lots of people that speak English. And you expects, you expats, expats speak uh, English. So we try and get it in English if we can. But uh, if not, I'll put some subtitles underneath. But my Maltese is not that great anyway. So we'll blunder along. Now he said lie, he said, I'll try and meet you by Vince's bar. But I might just go in myself. Would be nice. Uh, I don't know if his partner was going to come in and just... Because they know, they buy from here, local. They're all local. And this is a local bakery where... Oh, well, look at this here. We're walking around the, uh, the back streets of Rabat. This is the church here, St Paul's Church. All this area here was all church, apparently. Actually, the bakery is here somewhere in the back. There's a kid's uh, school here. Anyway, last one, set it all up, give him a thumbs up, tell him thank you, because I'm sure we can have, a, we can have some fun there. Uh, we we'll see the old oven, many years, hundreds of years old this is. Oh, this is a bit tight, the road over. It's got, there's kids' school over here. Oh, oh this is the bakery here, look. You can go in and buy apple pies, jam tarts, pdira, uh, hopsodam malti. It's some pause here. We're gonna meet La in the piazza somewhere. It's a lovely area, guy. Get a chance, come up here. Just many tourists at the moment. There's a lovely museum here. Actually, you can go underground to see uh, some Paul's catacombs. And the museum is um, here. Look, Winya Court is the one that built the aqueduct from all the way from Dingley down to Valletta. And also there's another catacomb which is up the top there. There's the St Paul's catacomb. They, I heard they said it was joint, but uh, I don't know if they've divided it off. But there's the museum of Winnie Court. If you want to go up to the left, is the place for St Agatha's and St Paul's catacombs. Here's his Vince's bar here. Everybody knows Lara in this area. Oh look how busy. <laughs> They're a bit impatient. So he's going to be here somewhere. I'll have a quick look around. This is the St Paul's church. Beautiful if you get a chance to come in. Many catacombs, as I said, around here. Uh, bars. Down here is where the Monty is. A lot, of, lot of lovely restaurants as well with some good food in this area. Down this area is the Sunday Market, just down this road. Going down towards that valley where they had the subsidence and I did the video of the new road layout. And up the top here, you can see it, look, there's a sign on top of, this is Vince's bar here, where all the lovely, lovely place. Down to earth, traditional coffee and tea in a glass. Uh, they do a theater while you wait as well. Not, none of this um, in the plastic, and it's done days before. So like, it's cut and done for you freshly in front of you. I think they do eggs and bacon and a traditional tuna theater. Hobbs Bazaar, everything like that. And now up there, look, there's a lovely little chapel. You can go down in the catacombs. Keep walking round and you come to St Agatha's and St Paul's. So I guess underneath, St Paul's catacombs joined with this one because if you go into this one, we knew court, 
restaurant, this museum I'm telling you here. There's a stairs that goes down. You have to pay to go in this one. Um, I'm not, I forget now, it's been before COVID when I went in, but it actually goes, here look, it goes underneath. This is, I'm not sure where it comes out now, but this is, can you see a little bit there, it's a bit dark. Those stairs go down to the catacomb, but you can only go in that if you're in the church, hoity-toity, <laughs> but you go this way and you pay. It's not expensive if it's five or six euros or something, that's all it is. Anyway, it's gonna, it's gonna start raining, I think. We're gonna try and get hold of, he said here somewhere. Uh, only got about five minutes. I said I'm gonna meet him at uh, 12 o'clock and it's five minutes to 12. But look at the history, look at the statues around here. It's awesome. <laughs> Let's see if we can find him. He's sure to be here. He's not having a coffee. This is my island in the sun Hello, la. Hey, uh, oh, I have got the Oh, Inti. Bomber. Bomber, hello, man. Shopping, something for you, sir. In for here, me? look. Oh, I don't need the anything. The biggest strawberries in the world. I've never seen them as big in my life. In the bar where you went and you didn't like it, Sa'aya Bar. Organic strawberries Sa grown by your brother in the fields of Amtafa. He went, he went digging in the fields? I've stolen them, yes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going in the bakery. We're going to. Oh, you're coming She's with me? just getting a pizza to oh, okay. take over the okay. little one. And, uh, it's been dripping rain a little bit. No way. Anyway, last one. Last set all this up is one of the oldest bakers, I think, in Malta. He's the oldest baker in the And he bakes with wood. He does the Hobza Tal Malti. So it's Maltese bread. We're going to see today how it's made. And Lars, thank you, Lars. He said right. everything all up. I've been waiting to get in here for about so four months. So, what you got? Can we have a soft in your bag? I bought a new waistcoat. Do you want to see it? Hey, he bought an awesome t shirt. I might go back and buy that extra large yeah, Babu one. To, yeah. Look at this. Oh, this is hand woven. Nice. And I've just had an extra birthday present of Frita. Oh, wow, that's Ain't nice. races, blue look, shirt, uh, grey jacket. You're going to look yeah. sharp. Yeah, I hope so. Every girl's crazy about a sharp dress, man. <laughs> Come on, we're going to go and have a look at this bakery. Here she is. But <laughs> she's the one that doesn't want to be on the, on the video, but we're not going to show her. Don't you no, worry. No, no, no. I can't afford to pay the royalty money for you. She's too expensive. Come on, I'm let's go ahead. and have a look, guys. Come on. It's up this road. <laughs> <laughs> It's gonna, it's gonna dump down, la. No way. Yeah, look at it. No. It's no. dripping already. Yeah, no. Anyway, it's up this back street behind St Paul's Church. It's one of the oldest bakers. I would guess in Malta, there's not many of them now doing with uh, Linyam, uh, the old-fashioned oven. I came here the other day and he said, do you have a chat with the owner? See if we can do something. It's very small, guys, and very old. Hello. Lovely people up here, Robert. Come and say hello to him. There's a school here. The boss is in. Oh, wow. Oh, that's good. Yeah, he's here. Let's go and have a look, guys. Hey, we're inside, guys, and this lovely guy. What's your name? Charles. Charles, you're going to show us a, around a little bit? Yeah. Okay. So, you want to serve some customers first? And I'll yeah, come okay, okay. Let so, me just... So, that would be, that would be there. Oh, okay. Yeah. We'll come inside here. Oh, look how nice inside. So, you can have a more, Eva, Eva. 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 It's nice though inside, eh? I want to push the camera, please. Bill All right. Yeah, yeah. Well, everything, call us a bit less in. That way, phone, what? Sorry. The oven is it? That's well antique. Oh, dear, antique, yeah. Look at the bread, guys, it's beautiful. Everything is. Uh... Hello, hey. what's this, me? This up here. Hello, Christopher. Oh, I'm English man in Malta. Oh, indeed. English man in Malta. Yes, Steve, uh, Steve. Steve, uh, yeah. Steve. We just come to do a little bit of uh, hops at our mouth. Hey, we're going to tell him now. Hey, we're here. That's the for it. All right. Oh, no, no. This is old. Oh, wow. Look Joe on the level, boys. Oh, okay. Look at this beer, eh? And they'll call it a bit Linyam uh, with wood. Yes. Cook yes. it, eh? Uh. Oh, Pogiak, uh, yes. uh, Linyam. Mm -hmm. And the hops at our mouth. Mm -hmm. Maltese bread. It's smaller, Mark. Yeah. They're getting smaller now. Yes. You're getting richer, you tell hops. 
Oh, pros, okay. So, like, I um, uh, came here in hops from the beginning. For, for Lordu, you, you start early, very early. Hey, man, I'm going to be late. Uh huh. And I'm going to show you this one. I'm going to this one. Tell you, Bill Martin, but I'll make subtitles. Yeah, I'm going to Ah, you're not the 33. Oh, this, oh, this. Yeah, 40 years. Wow, 40 years. 40 years, bacon. Bacon. Wow, tired, bacon. The antique, you know, it's a half now. Antique, yeah. Came like. Oh, Rabat, this is the old part, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, ye
this is it, uh, Falson Bay. I'll be careful not to. Uh... He told me it was built the same time as the church, so the church is here. If I can find the year of the church, and underneath here, in the ground, there's all catacombs. Anyway, I've got some bread. <laughs> 190, uh, two tiras small, and a hopsata malty. There wasn't much, it was a bit cramped in there, so I hope you were. Uh... I know it was a short video, but. Falson, come and have a look when you're in Rabat, it's a nice place. Really nice people. Bye guys, take care. <laughs> oh, Lars, having the sugi.